Tomorrow is one of the biggest drinking days of the year, St. Patrick's Day. The celebration's already underway tonight. Authorities around the state are trying to keep people safe. Metro North is banning booze from train stations and platforms. Police will be looking for you if, they're out, if you're out there drinking. News 8's Bob Wilson rode along with state police. He's live in Hartford with more on their efforts. Bob. Yeah, we're out from McGinnis Irish Pub. It's a great place to come for St. Patrick's Day. A lot of Irish drinking going on in there. A lot of fun being had. And also a lot of people being careful, especially on this holiday that's known for drinking. McKinnon's Irish Pub in Hartford, one of the places to go for St. Patrick's Day staples. Peanuts on the floor, good home cooked food, you know, bangers in mass, cottage pie. They've been around for 16 years, the bar back at least twice that as it was featured in the movie Officer and a Gentleman. It's a place where everyone goes with their friends to do what they do on St. Patrick's Day. It's St. Patty's. You get everyone kind of, you get hammered. Need some good food. And the bartenders serving the Guinness with a smile are also watching over the patrons. To make sure that they do make it home safely each and every time that they come out, whether it's St. Patty's Day or not. And as the bartenders are keeping an eye out for people leaving with car keys in hand, this afternoon, state police keeping an eye out for the ones that got away as troopers start their weekend DUI enforcement. A lot of people celebrate it throughout the state of Connecticut. Um, and like I said, it's uh, people drink and drive, but we'll be out heavy and uh, enforce the laws. Uh, DUI is also extremely costly. Not only do you have your car towed, but there's also prison time involved, heavy fines, and police say it's also dangerous, especially on the St. Patrick's Day weekend. It's a holiday that ranks right up there with Christmas and New Year's Eve. They're not in their uh, right state of mind, um, and they end up going the wrong way on uh, the highway or ramp or whatever, and, uh, you know, they do cause accidents. So as everyone is having fun in the pubs, state police recommend having a plan ahead of time. Appoint a designated driver, call a cab, but don't take the party on the road. Stay at home. Exactly. <laughs> I have plenty of Guinness in the fridge. <laughs> That's a good idea. If you don't want to, if you want to drink, you can stay at home too. Take the party at home. Everybody, be safe out there. Enjoy your St. Patrick's Day. I'm Bob Wilson, reporting live in Hartford. News eight.